Hello my friends, today we talk about Montreal. Uh, I live in Montreal from 2012. I kind of know the culture here a little bit. But what I would say as an immigrant is that there is a hidden, uh, there, there is a hidden uh, discrimination in the sense that mostly for the language part, you know, uh, the French and English always were fighting each other because it's kind of known that they didn't really, they don't really like each other. Uh, they had to measure wars here, but uh, the English prevailed eventually, except the Quiet Revolution that started before some decades. And what I, what, what I want to say is that French people in general have more satisfaction if you talk to them in French, because they, they kind of feel that they are a knowledge and their existence in Quebec because Quebec uh, it's kind of like their their fortress their their, their, their kingdom you know uh, what I want to say now is that uh, the people here are still uh, reserved you know shy reserved it's, it's not really what you think like okay it's Montreal it's is the best place in North America it has nothing to do with this anymore even when I came here 2012 till now many things have changed many things have changed uh, it's, it's for sure it's worse than it used to be uh, more expensive more uh, you know it's, it's more expensive more uh, difficult to communicate people you know technology brought a lot of problems to human communication as actually happened everywhere in the world everywhere in the world has the same problems like if you have that fucking technology the the networks it brings problems to communication what, what I want to say is that Montreal is about average to bad I would say not very very bad but it's average towards bad I wouldn't recommend to you to come to Montreal especially if you don't speak French it's, it's not a good place plus uh, there are many uh, French